itself is beautiful out here. We're at Fun in the Sun in San Diego. And I think you guys have a few questions for me. What are three things we don't know about you? I play guitar. I watch Saturday morning cartoons. I surf, but I really can't swim that well. We love all my children. We'll stick around and watch all my children. My wife and I tried so long to have a baby with no luck. Going to Dr. Madden was our last ditch effort. Mm, yeah, I know the feeling. My wife and I, same story. But that's the great thing about Dr. Madden. He's all about making families. Oh, thank God. No, this is so exciting. Listen, um, um, I, I know this is totally unexpected, uh, but I, I, I travel a lot in my business, and my territory is the Northeast. I was wondering if you'd be kind enough, if you'd be willing to meet and talk about the adoption process, you know, like uh, what to expect if there are any pitfalls. Oh, uh, yeah. I'd be happy to get together. Uh, but we've moved. We are literally out in the middle of nowhere. It's really hard to find. Uh, and believe me, at this point, you give me an address and a direction, I'm like a bloodhound. I'll find you. All right. I'm not going to retract my statement. What I said is true. I confessed in the story. All right, fine. You're just going to walk into prison. You made a mistake, JR. Dad, I tried to kill my wife. I know, I know. You've got some issues. Who doesn't? You think you're going to get the help you need behind bars? I'll be able to look at myself in the mirror, and I think that's a pretty good start. Oh, no, 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 you're a chandler. Every punk in that cell block will have it in for you. They'll all try to chew you up because their lives are so damn miserable. My whole life I've slid through. I've never once had to own up to all that crud that I pulled. Those drug charges when I was a kid, gone. The chandler way, sleep with the judge, pay off a witness, out a wing. I don't care, you know? This time, I do the time. There are other ways. You have to let me help you. Well, there's something that I'd like. Fine. It, anything. What is it? Well, I don't know exactly when they're going to schedule my plea hearing. But until then, I'd like to stay home and spend time with my son and my wife as much as I can. Of course. Where else would you stay? No, I'm not asking you. Look, what I've done, I'm completely ashamed of. I don't even deserve another hour with you or our son. But I can hope that you believe in my love enough to let me stay here until my sentencing. Thank you. You do not have to do one thing that he wants. Whatever you decide, I will back you up with both barrels if necessary. Crystal. This is for David J.R. to work out. Oh, yeah. I guess you can stay. Little A needs his daddy. Hey. Hey. He's terrific. So. How's Amanda Dillon? Aren't you still friends? Trying. She doesn't make it easy. Yeah, she's had a tough time. Well, it's about to get even tougher. Amanda's now decided she wants to be a surrogate. What? Oh, I know. It's crazy, huh? I mean, I'm not saying if Amanda couldn't handle it eventually, but now? After losing her father and dealing with her mom? And she's totally... Vulnerable? Yeah. And she just started working for Madden, didn't she? He's gotten to her, too? We have to stop this from happening. How's Kendall? Is there any improvement? I'm sorry. I wish there was something that I could do to help. You mean that? Of course I do. Then you will. Right now. I'm not following you. You're the baby genius, the guru, the miracle worker. You will save Kendall and her baby. Kendall is definitely her mother's daughter. She's got her fire, her drive. If there's anyone who can burn themselves through a coma and dance out those doors, it's Kendall. You're supposed to be the great liar. You can't trot one out right now. Oh, yeah, your sister's going to be fine. She's going to wake up, and she's going to walk out of those hospital doors with her baby in her arms. That's the lie I want to hear. 
just say it. Uh, even if it's not true, I just, I just want to hear the words. I'm sorry. I guess it's the white coat. Yeah, you gotta go all honest on me. Fine, just go do whatever doctor thing you need to do. Bianca, listen. I have no doubt that Kendall's gonna pull through this. The risks are high, but the odds aren't totally against them. It's not completely out of the question that they'll pull through this. No, seriously, I appreciate it. You get the plane ready, I swear I'll be there within the hour. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Okay, what's the plan? The plan is I just booked a ticket to Nowheresville, Maine. All right, when do we leave? We don't leave, I'm leaving. Hey, no, I don't, I don't, no. That's not gonna work for me, okay? We're in this together. I'll keep you in the loop. Tad, I have been searching for Kate over the entire planet. Do you understand what I'm saying? I'm not going to sit here and wait by the phone. <laughs> Dixie, at this point, I don't care what you do. What I'm saying is I'm not going to spend any time in a tin can with wings buckled up next to you. 